running MySQL dump in a cron job without exposing passwords. I want to run in a cron job. How can I do so securely? I know I could put the command right there, but anyone with access to the machine would see it straight away via crontab. Is there a better way to do it? Anyone with access to the machine has the same level of access to as to slash var slash lib slash mysql you allow them to have. So, set the proper permissions on the directories and done. Anyone with root access has direct access to the database files directly. Anyone you do not trust to have access to the machine should not have access at all to the machine. Usually folks only see their own cron jobs via crontab, L. Run the cron job as a specific user and use some simple bash logic to extract the password from a plain text file stored somewhere on the system with permissions that only allow the user, or perhaps group, to access it. So if the cron job runs as user example, the ownership of the file should be example example and permissioned 0400. You can also achieve a similar function using a user level .my .cnf. As stated in man dump, c6.1.2.1, end user guidelines for password security in the MySQL reference manual. An option file is the safest bet, not least according to the above reference. Giving it in plain text in crontab is not good, not least since the process command line by default is visible through PS for other users. The same actually applies for environment variables as explained in the reference. Relevant portion of the MySQL reference manual. Store your password in an option file. For example, on Unix, you can list your password in the client section of the .my.cnf file in your home directory. To keep the password safe, the file should not be accessible to anyone but yourself. To ensure this, set the file access mode to 400 or 600. For example, to name from the command line a specific option file containing the password, use the defaults file equals file underscore name option, where file underscore name is the full path name to the file. For example, section 4.2-3.3, using option files, discusses option files in more detail. Also see this URL. For backup purposes, consider having a read-only user in MySQL, like so. Miskeldump requires only select and lock tables privileges to do its job.